Rich Richard here with Statifying Football. It is bowl season, so there's going to be a bunch of videos. Some will have only one or two games, some might have like five games. This will be Friday, December 17th. There are two bowl games, the Bahamas Bowl and the uh, Cure Bowl. Uh, Bahamas Bowl is Middle Tennessee State Blue Raiders against the Toledo Rockets. MTSU went 6-6, six and six. Toledo was 7-5. Um, MTSU... Uh, they have a, you know, they got a good, a decent offense. They're number two in the nation in forcing turnovers. Decent offense and eh, defense. They have a safety. Reed Blankenship ship had 106 tackles. Jordan Ferguson seven sacks. Quarterback Quincy Riley had five interceptions. Uh, their quarterback Chase Cunningham was hurt, so Nick Faziato came in. Passed for 754, five touchdowns, six picks. Their leading rusher was Martel Petaway, 359 and three touchdowns. Jimmy Marshall, their leading receiver, 45 receptions, 510 yards, and six touchdowns. Where Toledo, they have a really good uh, offense. They're number 14 in pass defense, number 25 in scoring offense, and 27 in scoring defense. Declan Finn, 1855 passing, 16 touchdowns, only one interception, ran for 418 and eight touchdowns. Brian Kobach ran for 1,274 yards, 15 touchdowns. Devin Maddox, 38 catches, 562 and 4. Uh, linebacker Jonathan Jones had 89 tackles. Safety Maxon Hook also 89 tackles. Linebacker Jamal Hines, 10 sacks. And cornerback Samuel Womack with 14 passes defense. This has the potential to be a shootout, but Toledo seems to be the better overall team. Like I said, 25th in scoring, basically top 30 in scoring in uh, scoring offense and scoring defense. Um, if Middle Tennessee want, you know, I think if they have a chance, they'll have to force a lot of turnovers, which they can. Otherwise, I think this may be Toledo's game to win. <coughs> <coughs> and then the other game, the Cure Bowl, Northern Illinois Huskies and the Coastal Carolina Chanticleers. Northern Illinois went 9-4, won the MAC Conference. Rocky Lombardi, 2,416 yards, 13 touchdowns to 8 picks. Ran for 4 or 6 and 8 touchdowns. Jay Ducker ran for 1,038 yards and three touchdowns. Trayvon Rudolph, 49 catches, 877 and seven touchdowns. Um, safety CJ Brown, 103 tackles. Cornerback Jordan Gandy, 10 passes defense uh, there. Hit the number five uh, rushing offense in the country. Costa Carolina, though, went 10 and 2. Grayson McCall, 25 58 passing, 23 touchdowns, only three interceptions, and ran for four. Shamar Jones ran for 988 and 13 touchdowns. Javon Haley, 59 catches, 1,034 yards and 7 touchdowns. Uh, defensive tackle Josiah Stewart had 12 and a half sacks. They're number 7th in scoring offense, 6th in total offense, 21st in scoring defense, 16th in total defense. I think overall, Coastal Carolina is a much better team, at least statistically, than Northern Illinois. This could be kind of a low scoring game. Both pretty good rushing offenses, but... NIU's rush scoring defense is 110th. Coastal Carolina's got a really good offense, and I think Coastal Carolina will win this game possibly big, but they should at least win. So those are two bowl games for the December 17th. Check out my other bowl videos. Peace.